Hey everyone, my name is Alex Ramsby. I'm an MSP consultant here at Proval Tech. Today I wanted to go over an, an interesting customizable email format through Automate. Let's get into it. So if you open up Automate and go to your scripts, what we want to do is be able to create a custom, nice looking email that you can send to clients for any number of reasons. Um, you could send an offboarding script or like an email and that's what we'll go through today something like hey as you're you know leaving my msp or you know hey please uninstall the previous msps automate something like that you're trying to communicate something but you want it nice looking it's not just going to be plain text in an email you can actually just use the send email function and in fact i've just got a an example script here just called alex's testing email if i use the function send email it's more or less using just an SMTP with whatever information I give it. And so what I can do is I can send it to my email here, uh, give it a subject. Of course, it has to have one and same thing with a body. But inside the body, if I just hard code a, an HTML web page, basically, I can give it a heading, I can give it some text, uh, I can give it a link, uh, and then of course more text, and then just close it off with you know the HTML and body. And in this case, it will just send me an alert, offboarding automate, please use the following link to uninstall all traces of an automate agent. Here's the link to download. And then, you know, of course you can give it a friendly name that looks like the link if you don't want the link to be uh, the full actual link to show. And then of course more text, this will download the zip file inside the an executable, remove all files from an automate agent. And so if I actually run that and I open the the debugger here. Um, I am just running it against an online machine, just in our dev environment. And I hit start. You don't have to run it through the debugger. This is just the easiest way to run it kind of on demand. Wait for actually to communicate to the agent so that I can click finish. Give that a quick second. It'll run through the two steps here. Hopefully it won't tell me that the uh, script completed on error or anything like that. And then from there, I can actually open up the email itself, just double clicking. It'll give me the heading that I want, the text, and then the actual link. And if I if I do click this, it will on it will download the zip file that I have here. This is the actual uh, universal uninstaller that Kenneth kind of Twice has. So if you are communicating via email to a client, or you need them to uninstall something, or you have kind of a, a way to do that you can host a file and this is the uh agent uninstaller that i was referring to and then you can just run that it would remove all traces of automate and then just yeah like this is a great way to format a custom email in your scripts maybe um any number of reasons can really uh use this but i thought this would be a great tip hopefully you get some good use out of it and we'll catch you in the next video thanks for watching we post a new video every week to share our knowledge on Automate. To learn more about what we do, please visit ProvalTech.com. There's a link in the video description below.